Hello ladies and gentlemen, we're the crew of us. I'm Mikkel. And I'm David. And we're here to watch episode 9 of Agents of S.H.I.E.L.D. Episode 8? Episode 9. I think pretty sure it's episode 9. Yeah. Last time we had the Berserker, Berserker episode with the Asgardians. You know, the Asgardian. And then the people that wanted to be kind of like demigods. <laughs> yeah, they got like super strength and super rage. Yeah. So that was kind of interesting, right? Um, and the episode before that, we had the whole Siberia thing. Um, so we're, we're kind of getting through a couple of episodes now, and you know we're ramping it up to two times a week. So you can check it out over on Patreon if you want the full-length reaction for any of these episodes. All of them are over there. Uh, sorry for the bad setting in this video. Uh, it's only going to be a couple of videos. You know, only one Agents of Shield as I'm at Melissa's place right now. Uh, but hopefully you can live with that. Um, what do you think of the last episode? I think it was pretty good. Yeah. I mean, it was kind of a twist that he was an Asgardian, that guy. Yeah, yeah. Huge um, twist. Yeah, I didn't Sorry. expect that, but Coulson did. That's really important. <laughs> right. Um, I also like how we, I like how we got more uh, for like May's character. Yeah. Like, the possibility mm, for some yeah, backstory. Yeah, exactly. That was kind of what we were talking about wanting before we watched the episode, and that might yeah. might be what we we're getting. Um, we got more of Ward. Kind of got a little bit from everyone, which is kind of nice, you know, these, you know, episodes that we just kind of get to know more pe people better and stuff, you know, it adds to the overall story. So, we'll jump right into the episode, see what's gonna happen. Laboratory accident kills four. Hmm. I asked you a question. Stay away from me. Oh, oh. oh. she's got psychic powers. The hell? You have me. We have a mission. Any specifics? Wait, a telekinetic? I thought they didn't exist. We never verified one. That's why we're going to Batesville hmm. to conduct an index asset evaluation and intake. Particle accelerator explosion. I wonder if Hannah she Hutchins, knows what's going on. It didn't look like she did. Was it her fault? Maybe it's mm -hmm. her emotions that control it. Four technicians died in that blast. We'll determine the cause and see if there's any correlation between telekinesis spontaneously forming and a particle accelerator exploding. Well, it does use giant magnets to fire billions of subatomic particles into their antiparticles at the speed of light to create miniature Big Bangs, so... <laughs> it seems like a good place Damn, he's to smart. <laughs> Stun gun. Time to go. So much for the welcome wagon. <laughs> I never went to the academy. She's a freshman. Oh, they're gonna oh, prank her. Freshman. And being <laughs> pranked is an integral part of becoming a shield agent. Not more mandatory, really. <laughs> Why not give her the full shield academy experience? It would be unjust to deny her such a thing. <laughs> she brought you some water. You think she's very Christian? Or do you it's think okay. it's because of what I found? This is Melinda May. <laughs> I mean, do you think she was before or after? How did I get here? She might have been. She sedated you. She's the cavalry. Oh. Cavalry. Where does that name come from anyway? Ooh. You I don't know. I'll tell you. <laughs> of course not. You spent no time at the academy. A heavily secure compound. Manama, Bahrain. Multiple shield agents are taken hostage. Tortured for information. May's mission? Eliminate the threat. Do you think they're breaking her now? People. Not people. They could be. Entire squads of mercenaries. Her vehicle got totaled, so she rode in. And um, she had an M249 in each hand. Right. In each hand. And she rode in on a horse. I don't Hence know, the man. Name. Can you believe she brought that? A horse. Brilliant. God's punishing me. He abandoned me. He doesn't protect me anymore. That's why this is happening. Protect you from what? Demons, sir. 
She's blaming herself. It's guilt. It's all of it. She's broken. Pour over the accident site. If that tragedy gave her powers, we'd need to shut them down. If it wasn't her fault, even better. But until then, she's a danger to all of us. Oh. I'm not scared of her. Well, I am, but just because the cavalry shot a hundred guys on horseback doesn't mean she knows how people Wait. work. Horseback? Hmm. <laughs> Did you hear that? Fitzsimmons. It's 20. Trained assassins. And they crossed him off with one pistol. No support. Tobias Ford. Oh, I named one of the uh, technicians who died at the plant. Yeah, and he filed three safety complaints in the past month, each one in Hannah's department. She thought he was her friend, but he had it out for her. Sad part is, he was right. Fitz, look at this. What are we seeing here? It's as if the explosion tore open some sort of window. To, to hell. Oh. 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 Let someone else on this plane. Oh, that was cool. What was that? Echo. Oh. Plane's lost power. We're going down. Oh, no. Went in a little hot. I got it. God. Oh. My name is Sky. We haven't met yet. Do you believe in God? Honestly, not really. The only words that stuck with me were something Sister McKenna said from the Bible, I think. She said, God is love. This ghost is a man trapped between our universe and another. And perhaps that's how all ghosts are. It's a simple explanation, really. Simple would be a relative term in this case. God. <laughs> Just <laughs> teleports in and out. Yeah. Just showed up out of nowhere. <laughs> oh my god. How are you gonna beat that? I should be with Hannah yeah. anyway. No wonder she keeps screaming. I'll have keep sending in the cavalry. You're bound to get a reaction I'll, like that. I'll call her that. Why not? No normal person can shoot a hundred Bahrain. That's not how it went down. Whatever, 20. I just, I don't understand. She didn't that. have a gun. A civilian girl and a few of our guys were stuck inside a building being held by the followers of this gifted individual. She was always quiet. She just... She was warm, fearless in a different way, getting in trouble, pulling pranks. Oh no, yeah. Oh God. Oh, she got her out. Oh my God, she's came Oh, fast. What are you going to do? Fix the problem. Oh no. What happened? We were lost communication, and you were hit with a very large plumber's wrench. A wrench? <laughs> Any idea which direction May could have taken her? We'll deploy the golden retrievers. They're in here. <laughs> <laughs> this, is, this is no time for childish nonsense like this. Pranking was your idea, and obviously, I had <laughs> this little beauty before I knew there was a dimension jumping <laughs> psychopath in the mix. Bias? Is that you? Oh, God. I know. <laughs> Not really. He's gonna save me. I'm being dragged to hell for what I did. What did you do? Just loosen a few bolts, and then you'd visit. You have to let go before my people come and make you do it. If you care about her, and I know you do, let her go.
But the first to put sleep in a line. Can Fitz repair it? Nah. This one's a lost cause. But May isn't. If anyone can bring her around, it's you. You know what makes people tick. I wanted you paying close attention to the index, asset evaluation, and intake process. Because someday, you'll be really good at it. Even the best. Thanks, AC. Maybe you'll get to rename it. Good, because that name is super stupid. <laughs> <laughs> and if I keep you company? Sleeping peacefully. <laughs> Very clever, Simmons. I didn't. I didn't do it. Well, who then? Me. Look, the bugs should be off limits. Okay? <laughs> Don't laugh because I know it was one of you. As we were talking about, we got a little more information about me. You know, even though th this story kept changing, it kind of reminded me of Finding Nemo. Yeah. Me. So first, it was one hundred. Uh, Armed mercenaries. Yeah. Then was twenty assassins. Well, on horse. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> it ended up being some completely different with some people that were, you know, around this guy that was very special in some way and stuff, but you know. And I, I think changing the me. essence of the story is that she went in alone and kinda of lost herself in that situation. In general. Yeah. Um That's a good metaphor for it. Probably very different as and now she's cranking again. So this, <laughs> this, this couple episodes that has made her think of her past, maybe maybe that's helped a bit. You know, she seems to have a little more fun. Yeah. She's getting her old self back. Yeah. Kind of slowly. Oh, well, we don't know if she's going to get to that point of end. We don't even know what she was like before, you know. I mean, all we got to know was that she was a prankster. Yeah. That she was young and dumb, I guess. <laughs> Why is she young and dumb? Isn't that what you typically say about people who pull pranks and stuff like that? Oh, I don't know. She seemed very... I don't know. She, I don't know. You know, she was probably very disciplined, too. And I like pulling pranks. For, yeah, for Colton compared Old May to Sky. Yeah. But... I don't know if she can get that. that. You know, I think it takes some different kind of... Um abilities and just in general traits about your person to be like sky a hacker that's very good with people you know maybe might have been too but you know also may you know with with her training how good she's become at you know different martial arts and stuff right and just yeah. in general also shooting and everything i think it takes two different types of people kind of even though yeah. their, their fundamental traits might be the yeah. same you know i think there's a lot to that too. So, and I kind of enjoyed how I I wanted to know what what the fuck happened with that guy, right? But they were comparing it to like Thor going through portals and stuff. So they they it might be something like that. Yeah, but like me, you know, the reactor blew up. Yeah. And uh, or the what was it called? Was it just a the, it's not really a reactor? No, it was a it was a particle accelerator. Yeah. Yeah. Maybe he got kind of like stuck in between both the worlds, and then he was like shifting between them. Does that does that uh, then uh, does, does Agents of Shield tell us that uh, many worlds theory is true then, hmm. where one electron goes into a, 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 a you know you know you know in our you know you know this is fundamental <laughs> reality right, and then we send an electron through it. It goes right for us, but then it splits and copies our entire world. And it goes left for the other. So there's hmm. these many, you know. It's it's obviously you know. I've I've heard quite a lot of podcasts about this, but you know, it's not like you know, you making a decision is gonna do that. It's gonna happen trillions of times, like like that. <laughs> Although yeah. the place right because it's it's not really you know you don't change the electron. But I kind of I kind of like it delving into the multiverse kind of thing. Yeah, I mean, serious people believe that about about all world. Serious people, 
quantum physicist, right? Quantum mechanics. Yeah. Right? yeah. I don't know. <laughs> it's just kind of fun to think about. That that might be a thing, you know, where he got stuck in between or something, some weird habit. But I don't know. They might go into that later. We might get to see some other things that are going to be like comparable to this. Um, but he, event, he, it was his fault. Um, yeah. Because he loosened a lot of stuff probably throughout the years, maybe. And you know, if, if you do that on purpose for a long time just to get her there every day to fix it, right? Um, I don't know. It, it would just do. Uh, he was the technician. Why did he do that to get her there? Do you think it's because <sighs> if he changes stuff, the uh, outcome of of different uh, like experiments are gonna change? And then you know she's gotta go there every time and be like, oh, well, why is it changing? I gotta get here again and research it. Do you think it could be something like that? It could be so like maybe he, changes maybe he just some wanted stuff. To... yeah but he wanted to see her there so like he changes some small things right and it's 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 ultimately going to change the outcome of the experiment maybe and she's going to go there more often to test more and be like why is it changing i don't know mm -hmm. it could be a thing like that but you know i don't know if she would she was like the, the leading person that was there at that time at least i don't think she's like technician I no, I think he's the like, uh, yeah. Um, so I don't know. It's 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 kind of weird, but you know, uh, it kind of kind of just uh, a light bulb kind of ignited when I when we saw him, um, yeah, blocking no. the lock or whatever it was. Uh, you know, it was like, oh, that's so weird. And at first, I was like, oh, he he just wants to torment her. He doesn't want to like let her be hurt, but he he wants like psychologically to get into her, right? Yeah. To get to her, but then it was like, <laughs> then, then you know, it, all of this he did for her, kind of. Every person yeah. that was angry at her, he he was angry yeah. at them. He couldn't control it. So he even you know in the store at at the house, everything. He's even 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 shield. Uh, yeah. Because he thought they were angry at her. So yeah, crazy episode actually. There's a lot. Yeah. There's a lot to this. <laughs> What do you think of um, uh, what are uh, his, his the pranks and stuff? <laughs> like, <laughs> I was well, like, Fitz's prank even ended up scaring himself. Yeah, he was the most scared <laughs> out of all of them. But the funny thing was, you know, it's like they told a story to prank her, right? And yeah. We, and we were like, is this a prank? And then uh, someone smiled, and we were like, oh, this is definitely a prank. And it wasn't even that good because it was, you, no. know, <laughs> you know, it was crazy what she did, obviously, right? But when Ward yeah. told it, even that was a prank. <laughs> he probably <laughs> knows what happened, or maybe he doesn't. But you know, Sky does, so he probably knows, kind of too. Um, but he was also pranking, and then it, it just seemed their their prank seemed so much worse because, it, you know, it was like it was still like in for him like twenty men, right? That's still crazy. They just ramped it up to a hundred, and then yeah. it was still you know only a pistol, not even two guns, right? But then it wasn't on <laughs> horse. But it was even worse than if it had been, you know, like nothing she did. <laughs> they could have yeah. rammed it a lot more up, and it would still not be that good of a prank. No. <laughs> Just in general. <laughs> um, yeah, we'll see. We'll see if I can sneak a prank into it. Prank in on David. <laughs> the next bit, I don't know. We could do, like, pranks. We have Melissa Jones in again. Prank her. Doesn't, doesn't take much. <laughs> no. Um. Yeah, I guess that was kind of it for this episode. I don't know if it, you know, I, I told that about the setting. Um, this is probably the only reaction that's gonna be here. Um, so we'll be back at the great lights next time. <laughs> at least <laughs> on my side. You already got one of those softbox lights, David. Yeah. It's working pretty well, actually. Isn't it? Have you turned yeah. it on? Actually, no, I haven't. <laughs> oh, well, you're just using sunlight? I mean, uh, there's snow outside, so it's even brighter. Yeah, true. Actually, Watch this you. looks even better. Yeah. Well, you got <laughs> you got some good David at the end. <laughs> right? Um, but yes, you guys, for the next reaction, uh, we, we're kind of ahead, so I don't know when. We're three, so this will be up Wednesday. Next one will be up Saturday. So see you at on Saturday for the 10th episode. Hopefully you enjoyed the reaction. Leave a like if you did. We're trying to hit 10k before the year's over. So, you know, subscribe to the channel if you want to. 
and I'll see you guys for the next reaction. Bye. Bye.